Hey there everyone, this is Double Kick Sanji, and, well, yeah, I'm a plushie right now. Totally not a ripoff of Little Karibo or Vegeta 3986, or whatever his last four numbers are right now. Anyway, here I am with just a quick little update, because obviously I guess not everyone sees the bulletins that I post up, but... <clears throat> I have a backup account, Devil Kicks on G2, and I would like every of my subscribers and friends to add and subscribe to it, because I've got around two strikes on my account, so it's only a matter of time before I get terminated like many other people on YouTube have been getting terminated and all that. So yeah, be sure to subscribe, otherwise, oh, get, get, okay, otherwise you'll get a kick to the face. Yeah, I went there. Okay. The main purpose of this video is to pretty much go over my entire collection that I've been building up over the years. Yeah, I know, the whole, why should I care because it's not your collection thing, but it's not only just for people to watch on YouTube, but it's also for me as well. So, yep, let's move on to the collection. My collection is broken up into four CD wallet binders. This is the first one, a case it that holds 400 DVDs. Here's the second one, a case logic, 336er. Another one, 336. This is the third binder. And the last binder, another case logic. Now, before I go opening up the wallets, I will notify that there are some empty spaces in there to make room for future DVD purchases as well as some other not-so-anime titles, i.e. some Adult Swim shows or, hell, even some Cartoon Network shows. So, yeah, don't go get surprised when you see something that's not anime and go, oh, that's not anime, why is that in there? So, yeah. Okay, let's move on to the first wallet. First series, Oh My Goddess. Cost me around 40 bucks from, a, from Best Buy. Pretty damn good series. And if you're wondering, yeah, this is pretty much what I'm going to be doing, going through my entire four wallet collection, just showing off the discs, because due to a house fire in 2005, I lost quite a few cases, so if I was to show off the cases, I'd be missing some. Yeah, ooh, I Yori Aoshi. Another series I got off of Best Buy was a freaking bundle pack that came with the first series as well as Anishi. Got this for around 50 bucks. Pretty good series, though. I wish they would have properly finished it. Then we have the Akira DVD Special Edition set. Cost me around 20 bucks. I want to say I got this off Amazon quite a few years ago. Okay. <clears throat> if you can read that, this is Amazing Nurse Nanako. Disc 1, 2, and... Three. And if you're wondering what that orange thing around it is, those are D-skins. Yeah, I really don't like the front of the discs either to get scratched, so I put these on the front side to keep them protected. And then here we have Angel Links. Okay, moving on. The rest of the Angel Links set got this at around 25 bucks Best Buy. Animatrix, yeah, I got that. Got that for around ten dollars. Okay, here we have Arcade Gamer Fabuki. Would have never even heard about this anime if it weren't for. I want to say it was Full Metal Chow and Scourge Master ninety three and their little abridgings of it. Got this for around fifteen. Now here's like an interesting little item in my collection: the little any mini DVDs that ADV put out. Just a tiny little DVD that has the first episode of Azamanga Dayo. So yeah, I'm like, why not? Then we have the old Azamanga Daio individuals. Volume 3, 4, 5, and 6. Got all these from Best Buy. Ooh, Bakano. Another classic. Again, Best Buy around 16 bucks when they were having a sale during the summer. Last summer. Bastard got this little baby from GameStop for around seven dollars. Ah, Angelic Lair, twenty bucks thin pack from Best Buy. Pretty good series, pretty good. Ah, uh, Battle Royal High School. 
bit of an obscure title, but I'm sure if anyone watches Who Is Your Anime, you'll notice that he did a review on this one. Meh, I thought it was pretty decent. Okay, here we go, non-anime title, <laughs> Best of Beavis and Butthead. These are some of the older individuals by Time Life. So yeah, those are here, as well as the Mike Judge collection versions. <laughs> yeah, these are cool. <laughs> uh, shut up, Dillweed. <laughs> I always found these funny. <laughs> right, Volume 2. And then Volume 3. I think I got these ones from Sam Goody before they went out of business a few years back. And of course, we can't have the series without the movie. Frickin' epic. And yes, before anyone says anything, Ben 10. I actually like the Ben 10 series. Shoot me, why don't ya? <laughs> but I only got the first two seasons so far. And the movie, I'm a completionist. Then we have the old Berserk series. Not the remastered version, the first season reissue of the series. It's a pretty good series, but dear god, I got so fucking pissed at that ending. Or lack thereof. Let's see here. Then we have The Old Birdie the Mighty. Pretty good series as well. Got these with a double pack. I forgot exactly with what other ones. I think it was Demon City Shinjuku and a win named Amnesia. Otherwise, this is a pretty good series. I do plan on picking up the Funimation version. And now we move on to Bleach. Freaking loved these sets. I mean, dear God. Around 30 bucks I paid for these for five discs? These were freaking sweet. Second season. Then we move on to the third season, which ended the Epic Soul Society arc. Then we moved on to the Bound Arc, which, to its credit, is not that bad. I mean, yeah, having to wait every week for an episode was a piece of shit because, I mean, that arc moves slow, but marathoning it ain't that bad, really. So, yeah, this is all I have of the Bleach series. I have a little space here for the other subsequent ones. So, yeah, those are empty spaces. Have the first movie, Memories of Nobody. And the second movie, got those two from Walmart, around 20 bucks each, so not bad. Blood Rain, Curse of the Yoma. I'll be honest, I still technically haven't seen it. I kind of got it as a gift. So, yeah. And then we move on to Dokoro-chan. <laughs> Freaking epic show, but... Uh hate the fact they ended up releasing an English dub way after the fact I bought this subtitled only version. Blue Gender. Pretty good series. Saw it on Adult Swim for the very first time. Okay, just four, five, six, seven, eight, and the movie, which was meh. Around 40 bucks. Okay, since it's hard to read this, this is the Blue Submarine number 6 special edition set. Now, I did not know that these were double-sided discs, so needless to say, I was pissed off. So, I mainly got this one for the special edition disc. Then I ended up rebuying the individuals. Because this series, or this OVA series, is win. Then we move on to the Boondocks. Fucking epic satire series. Season 2. Then here's another weird series, Brack Show. Yep, an Adult Swim show, and I fucking loved Brack Show. Mm hmm. Now we have the original Burn Up. Burn Up W. And then one of my favorites, Burn Up Excess. It's fucking hilarious. Okay, and then the last one, Burn Up Scramble, which was pretty good. Got these puppies off of Amazon. Separately, but it didn't cost me no more than 20 bucks to get the whole series. And, okay, these are going to be really hard to read. 
And if you can make that out, it's pretty much the entire Card Captor Sakura series. Yep, got these on sale from Robert's Anime Corner Store, selling all the whole series for around $70, so needless to say, I picked that shit up. Heh, <laughs> you can see my wall scroll on the reflection there. Yep, Misa Misa. Okay, since these pretty much all look the same, can't really appreciate any of the art of the pictures there, because they're really hard to see. But yeah, go through those. Uh -huh. Last two discs of Car Captor Saga, and then we move on to the movies. The first movie, and then the special edition of the second movie. <clears throat> then we move on to Chobits. Pretty good series as well. Actually, I bought all of these ones from a GameStop used, but technically they were new. Something about the manager buying it, losing the receipt, needing money, so he had to trade these in to get his own GameStop for extra cash, and I picked all these up for around five bucks a piece. Pretty damn good deal. Then we have Chronicles of Riddick, Dark Fury. Huh. That could have been more entertaining. The Chronicles of Riddick, my ass! <laughs> Let's see, Chrono Crusade, another good series. Got this, I want to say a few months after the house fire in 05, from an ADV sale they had on their website, having each disc for around five bucks each, so I thought, what the hey? Ooh, Clerks, the animated series. <laughs> Fucking love this little series. They so should have made more. Oh, colorful. Pretty good. Pretty good. Completely mindless. You just have to totally leave your brain at the front door before watching this to appreciate it. Cosplay Complex. Three episode OVA. Not bad. Left off for a sequel, but never got it. Ah, uh, here's the shit Cowboy Bebop remix. Hell yeah. Every anime fan should freaking love Cowboy Bebop. Uh, should have known though that they were gonna make a freaking box set. Ended up buying all of these things individually. 20 bucks a piece. Uh, should have known better. And we have the movie. Who Cromarty High School fucking epic series. Oh man. I swear to God, though, what the hell were they smoking when they made this shit? <laughs> Third volume and fourth volume. Ah, here we go to Deers. Recent series I got off of Amazon, got them all individually from third-party sellers. First, second volume, third volume, and the fourth volume, which is the first one I got because they were starting to really charge up the yin-yang for this one. Just try going up on Amazon. If you're lucky, you'll find it for, like... Seven dollars used or recently I saw one for like five bucks brand new, but now they're like freaking over fifty dollars So yeah Now we move on to death note Yeah, it's a little overrated, but what can I say? I liked death note Third volume fourth volume and the fifth volume. I got these on those special viz box sets that held five discs a piece So yeah, that was a good deal and oop, moving on to the next side. <laughs>